What's up guys, in this short tutorial, I will show you how to fix network lag, packet loss and the high latency while playing Star Wars Battlefront 2 on your PC. This should be quite an easy tutorial, everything you need will be listed in the description below. First, we will take a look at your in-game settings. In your account settings, under multiplayer settings, make sure to set the ping site option to the closest server to you. This might be one or two locations, depending on where you live. And changing this option can already help you out a lot with network related lag. When this is done, you can close the game and make sure to account for any VPN service which could be running on your system. Or turn off your VPN while in game. Before making any tweaks on your system, I'd recommend to verify the Star Wars Battlefront 2 server status. Everything you need will be listed in the description below. On this page, you can preview hourly reports for server issues, which can help you figure out if the error is caused by the game's server or if it's on your end. Below, you can preview the live outage map to see where the problem is coming from. The second link shows current issues with EA and their online services. In case the servers in your area seem unaffected, then the issue might be related to your own network connection, to software running on your system or to the game files. Make sure that your game files are complete and up to date. In your origin launcher, navigate to the game library. Here, right click Star Wars Battlefront 2 and select repair. This will take a minute to re-download and reinstall any missing or corrupted game files. In case the issue is related to your own network connection, then make sure to test your connection by visiting speedtest.net. A normal app and download speed without interruption is important to have a stable gaming experience. Especially your ping should remain below 100 milliseconds. Make sure to use an Ethernet cable to ensure the best possible connection. If you have to use a Wi-Fi connection, then make sure to restart your router or modem if you haven't done this in a while and reduce the amount of devices connected to the same network. When this is done, open up your task manager by right-clicking your taskbar and selecting it. Here, navigate to your resource monitor as you can see in the video. In your network tab, open up the processes with network activity and after a few seconds you will see every process using your network connection. This might be your browser running in the background, Steam, or a download bottlenecking your connection. I suggest you to only add the processes which you know won't break your operating system. Next, open up your command prompt by searching for CMD and hitting enter. Use the command ping google.com. This command will check your latency and packet loss to Google servers. If your ping is higher than 100 milliseconds, or if you encounter any packet loss, then make sure to make a few changes to your connection and follow the next tweaks. Use the command ipconfig slash flush DNS. This will flush and reset the contents of your DNS resolver cache. Using this command can in some cases fix network related issues with Star Wars Battlefront 2. In case you still have latency and lag issues, then you should verify your connection to your ISP and make sure that you're using a decent data plan. You can troubleshoot this step by switching your connection to your personal hotspot for example. When this is done, we will change your DNS server address in case the issue is still caused by your network connection. Use the shortcut Windows key and R and in this dialog box, enter control and hit enter. This will open up your control center. From here, navigate to network and internet, network and sharing center, and here select your connection. This will open up this window, containing some general information about your connection. Navigate to properties, and lastly, double click the internet protocol version 4. Select to use the following DNS server addresses option, and as your preferred DNS server, use 8888. And as your alternate DNS server, use 8844. This will for a lot of users fix a problem when playing Star Wars Battlefront 2 online, as these are the official 
public DNS server addresses from Google, which are safe to use. Lastly, in case you still get network-related issues, then you most likely have software running on your system, which is hindering you from playing the game. To fix this, I suggest ending processes from running in your task manager of recently installed programs which can change your game files or use up your available resources, such as OBS, Shadowplay, CCleaner or Adobe applications to troubleshoot which program is causing the issue. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.